Hi, this is Dell3524 here, and today we're going to be doing uh, some upgrading on my Optiplex 745. We're going to be putting in a new hard drive and some more RAM. Alright, so I got a Samsung SSD 850 Evo, and then I also have 8GB of DDR2 RAM Nanya. It is the 800 MHz. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. I already took the cover off, you just have to pull the little thing back on the side and flip it up. So then you're going to want to go over here, lift up on this blue tab. This should pull back. You can just set that off to the side there. And then also you can do the same thing with the floppy disk if yours is equipped with it. And that's going to give us where the hard drive is. Alright, so to get the hard drive out on these, all you got to do is push these two blue tabs in and, it, and slide it back and it should pop right out. There we go. And then just lift up because they're on crack. And there it is with the shelf. And then all you got to do is unplug the blue SATA cable and the power cord. You can just set this aside. All right, now before we go ahead and replace that, I'm going to put these, set these back down over here so we can do the RAM on it. All right, so the RAM is going to be located right here. Pretty much the same from all the way to the 745s, 620s, the 5 series, 4 or 3 series. It's pretty much on all the same spot. So then you just pull back on the tabs. And you can lift those right out. So, before you do this, if you're doing all four, you can just ignore this. But if you're only doing two, make sure you put them, uh, if you just have two of them, do dim slot one and dim slot two. Don't mix them all around. Or you can do dim slot three and dim slot four. Alright, to install these, it's just the same as always. Match up the uh, open space in there with the spacer down in the slot. Alright, so let's go ahead and open up this SSD. Here's the SSD. Even if I can get it out of here. All the drives and uh, manuals, and then you also get the driver for the CD, but I already have one. Alright, so here's the SSD. Now you're probably wondering, well, this is going in a desktop. This is a 2.5 inch SSD, but the desktop has a 3.5 inch bay. So what you'll have to get is a adapter caddy. Um, I'll show you a picture of the one I got. I'll put it somewhere on the screen here. But it hasn't come yet, so I'm going to have to put it in when I get it. But it also has, uh, there's the hook or the handle on it. Uh, more than likely, you're going to have to cut that off when you get it because it's probably not going to fit. In here, it might, but you probably have to cut it off. And then it has holes on the side of it that you can put the screws in, but we're not going to do that for the moment. Okay, so pretty much all you're going to want to do is line up the SATA cable, which is the blue one, onto the smaller set of pins. And same thing with the power. And that should just clip right in. And then you can set that right down there again. I don't have the caddy. So we'll just have to make with do for right now. And then you're going to want to take your floppy drive. Put that back down in there. Line it up with its corresponding slots. That should clip right back in. And the same for the CD drive. 
push that back down. And then it'll click into place. And you're just going to put the cover back on. And you're all set. You can boot it up. It'll ask you if you change the memory to. You'll just hit F1 because it knows the change. And then you just have to install Windows. Alright, that's how to upgrade the RAM and then put an SSD in a 745. Any comments, questions below?